This here is not the usual for the channel, but I got to admit, one of the reasons that I'm kind of fascinated in this is because it's a mystery and also it's getting tremendous views. I think this post here has over 30 million views in about a day or two, which is pretty significant. Major political figures and things like that get those type of views, but generally not like celebrity stuff like this, unless it's pretty special, like a once in a decade or once in a lifetime achievement or whatever. But the other interesting thing is there's like 6,000 comments on this. Now, generally, comment videos aren't fantastic. But in this case, I think there's going to be some pretty strong opinions, so it should be more interesting than the usual comment stuff. Anyway, my opinion is if it's her choice, and it's legal in that state, which it is in some states, okay, that's that. But we don't know that yet. And I don't like people assuming it's him controlling, because we got to know for sure. And I'm not saying it isn't. It could be. But think of it this way. In this day and age, with all the lawsuits and things like that, if he was controlling her, she could say, hey, I'm moving out. She says goodbye. I'm suing you. I'm taking you to court with all these pictures in public, I'm saying you forced me, she'd probably win the case. As long as she had some kind of evidence, she could easily record him. She wouldn't have trouble getting evidence. So that's why I gotta think, it's probably her choice for clicks and attention and things like that. Maybe he pushed it along a little bit, but okay, I mean, you know, in the end, she's gotta do it. And also, for someone to do something like this psychologically, I think, it would be really hard to force upon someone. But anyway, that's my take. I'm not ruling it out. It's just that if you've got that theory, then we got to hear a bit more from you on how and why. Bianca wardrobe, and it's empty. Ha ha. Okay, so here's the frontal pic. It's a little bit weird, and I got to say, he's dressed pretty weird too. What's with that helmet and poncho type thing? Ozzy Osbourne and Sharon Osbourne dress up as Kanye West and his wife for Halloween. Okay, that's pretty funny if it's actually them. It looks a little young to be the actual Sharon Osbourne, but okay. I will admit, her face does look pretty weird at times. So like I said, it's an open mystery. I can't say one way or the other exactly what's going on, but that's kind of why I'm interested. I just want to know. This person says, is it a humiliation kink? Which is possible it exists it's a pretty far stretch to go in public to play it out but okay bianca loves to show off that just could be as well i don't understand these two at all she's usually wearing little little clothes or see-through fits meanwhile he's fully clothed and masked up head to toe scratch his head too art house for me not sure what virtue there is in showcasing your woman like a trophy in the public eye yeah, I've wondered that too. Like, generally, you don't really want to showcase her that much. It's kind of weird. Maybe she wants to dress that way. Who knows? Yeah, we need more information. Here's one of her kind of smiling. I feel like it's Kanye's goal to humiliate her, and I can't understand why he went from hating Kim's tight clothes to having his current wife completely naked. It's not a good look. She's not completely naked. Completely naked means completely naked. She's got see-through clothes on. You cannot see her bottom part at all. Just saying. Call it what it is. But yeah, pretty close. Right, so he is always wearing these beehive master little outfits. You know, like he's going to get the bees out of the tree and he doesn't want to get stung, so he's got all that stuff on. Anyway, I'm an ex as well. Let me know what you think in the comments. All in all, in the end, we need more info. Even if they say something that's not true, we could still think about it and analyze it. This is kind of an extra topic for me. If you're not subscribed here, I'm doing pop culture entertainment, whatever comes up with Depp, Manson, Megan and Harry, things like that. If you're not subscribed here, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time.